Just when you thought I was safe to go into the theater again. The Fish and Ships, Improvisational Insanity Theater Corps brings you a story of good and evil, of one man's courage and another's revenge. From back alleys everywhere, we bring you a saga of the battle for galactic turf. Rat Side Story. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> it is a spaceship. I told you we should check it out. Oh, look. Goldfish. <laughs> How many <laughs> <are you? laughs> What did he be? What did he be? Isn't that some place in Ohio? <laughs> Remember now, it was discovered by a little old lady from Leningrad. <laughs> no, that was Cleveland. <laughs> oh, oh, shit! <laughs> superior intellect. We ate our oranges. Captain, don't you realize who this is? Why, certainly. This is, uh, this is... What did you say your name was? Conglion Singh, Imperator Expostriorum Adam Nagam Ad Nostrum. Yes. You may call me Sir Short. Captain Trell, please believe me. I met this maniac on the Enterprise 15 years ago, and I wasn't even there. <laughs> On the ship. Why, well, certainly. All of you, please, follow me. Captain Terrell, what's gotten into your head? Don't you realize? These are bad guys. <laughs> I think mean, they're not nice people. They're going to use us to get to Genesis so 
I can go after an admiral gun. No, these things usually involve pain. <laughs> and believe me, you know. <laughs> Oh, yes, and fringe also. <laughs> <laughs> Personal message on the comm link. Would you like to put on the screen? Yes, Mrs. Fox. Carol! Yeah? <laughs> what in the name of God are you doing? Reading, why? <laughs> <laughs> I tried to do one little biological experiment. All right, all right, another little biological experiment. <laughs> Oh, 
control? Doctor, it is Vulcan control that makes her ask first. <laughs> But sometimes, unavoidable, Mr. Spock. God, it's been a long time since I was in combat. The anticipatory thrill of that ultimate strategy. Wit, training, challenge, skill. Pitting against the intellect. Almost as great as my own. <laughs> and, most importantly of all, Mr. Spock, winning. <laughs> Certain I sent it your foul stench. <laughs> that Ukrainian misfit. You must mean Commander Chekhov. What is he doing on your ship? Or rather, what are you doing on his ship? And speaking of Chekhov, why am I being shot at? <laughs> because I'm trying to kill you. Oh, yes. It's imminently logical. Damn, hold it, You two, not now. <laughs> Con. You can do whatever you want to me, but please, don't hurt my ship. I've already hurt your ship, Admiral, and I wish to go on. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you give me all information pertaining to the Project Genesis. That should be quite simple. Can't you even exaggerate for the sake of the ship, Spock? No! You're always worried about your infernal body. We can't fire back. 
We must retreat. Retreat? How can you say that? <laughs> Very easily. <laughs>
He's there, Jim. <laughs> Return to the ship. Clean us up, Mr. Scott. They've gone into that nebula, sir. Well, that's that. We lost them. Might as well just go on to conquer a world. Uh, Deno. No, Wrigley's. I know. Argelia. <laughs> Follow them. What? But, sir, we, we, can't, we can't possibly track them in that nebula. We, we'd be killed. Why do you want to do a thing like that? Because I feel nasty, very nasty. I feel ruthless and toothless and vile. And so nasty, I'll annihilate you with a smile. <laughs> and delicious, and malicious. It's delicious how vicious I feel. I'm so nasty. That I hardly can believe I'm real. Who's the best man in that blues be there? Is he player looking at attractive female? Oh, 
this guy, he's on board the Enterprise. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Reporting for duty! Oh, here we go! He's trying to murder you, oh, sir! Stop! Sit! Sit! Stay! Sir, it was because of my navigating that they moved me to security. <laughs> Considering the present circumstances, I think you'll do fine. Take your post. <laughs> Sir, where is the bed you are? <laughs> we could navigate in here. Carry on, Mr. Chuck. <laughs> there they are. Oh. Is the superior? What? What? Superior? What? <laughs> I'm dead, asshole. <laughs> my ship, my crew, we're, we're dead, dead, asshole. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Curse you, James Kerr. I'll take you all down with me. I still have Genesis. Or I'm every inch king. When I do stare, see how that subject wakes. I pardon that man's life. What was thy call? Mr. Sard. Load him up. Oh, excuse me, Admiral. But I must go down to engineering and expose myself to a lethal dose of radiation. <laughs> <laughs> Jim, I just thought you should know. I mean, Spot. I'm busy here. Have fun, okay? Uh, <laughs> 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 oh, that if we blow them up now, with Genesis still on board, we'll go through all of us. Boom! Come on, Admiral! Admiral, the mains are back online! Bless you, Scotty! <laughs> 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 we are saved! Jim? Jim, there's a man in the reactor. Oh, I know, Bones. That's just Spock. <laughs> oh, my God! <laughs> Seems to be somewhat in error, Doctor. <laughs> Jim. <laughs> Spock, I'm over here. <laughs> Jim, I wouldn't die without saying goodbye. Spock, don't talk like that. You really sound awful. <laughs> I never took the Kobayashi Maru. What do you think of my solution? Frankly, Spock, it sucks. <laughs>
beautiful planet out there. This biological experiment certainly worked out. Better than the last one. <laughs> We've reached cruising speed, Admiral! Continue cruising. <laughs> oh, there's a cute guy over there. Wait till she goes, Admiral. <laughs> and here I thought we had the old crew back on board. <laughs> all points considered, I guess things won't be all that bad. How do you feel, Jim? How do I feel?